Hey, happy Vlogmas slash Bookmas. <laughs> Get those chestnuts away from my face. <laughs> Today I'm going to do an actual like vlog, a daily vlog, and it is Saturday, December 12th. And I'm currently going to go run and drop off a couple things. I'm dropping off a Secret Santa present and I, I just sold something on Mercari. So I'm going to go to the post office and do that, grab a Sonic drink, and then come home and uh, get some filming done. Um, unbox my secret Santa present I got yesterday. You won't see that um, until the 20th. I believe we're posting our secret Santa unboxings. So stay tuned for that. And yeah, clean the house a little bit. Maybe read. I have not read anything <laughs> like all month, but we'll get there. I'm going to hit that goal, y'all. Um, I'm kind of, I'm in, since I uh, read, since I built my bookshelf, and put my books on it I've been staring at my comics a lot lately and I, it's been a minute since I read my any comics so I think I might read some comics so we might do that and try to get my reading mojo back in action so let's go happy Saturday two hours later Woo! I'm free that took forever Let's see, what time is it? 1.06. The post office closes at 1 on Saturdays. Whew. And I believe I got here at like 12.30. So it wasn't too bad, but that was a long line. <laughs> Next stop, Sonic Drink. Why are there la lines everywhere? I'm gonna get my car washed. Another line. Goodness. Is it cause it's nice out? Also, it's 121. <laughs> so, so yeah, I'm one of those people that don't change their clock when it's daylight savings. Um, I usually just wait until it changes again. <laughs> or like my husband changes it. Cause I just don't have the patience to stop and change it. And then it's off by like, what, six minutes? <laughs> I mean, I'm always late anyways, so does it really matter? No, it doesn't. Okay, we get to start doing our Pez advent. So Penny's gonna start with what number? 12. 12, so let's find number 12. The 12, 12 is very hard to find. I hit it very hard. <laughs> is it one of the bottom ones? Tree. You put it in the tree? Yes. No, that's number 10. Oh, okay. <laughs> what about this one? Huh? This one. That one? Seven. Seven. Man, this one's hard. Is it this green one? <gasps> Twelve! Yeah, let me see. Twelve! We found it! You get to eat all of it? Yep, it's all yours. Ow. This is really good, guys. Okay. Don't get rushed. Can I get people? <laughs> Hi. It's way later and of course I'm not read anything, but I'm gonna wash my makeup brushes. 
Don't, don't, don't. Oh, right in my eye. <laughs> so I guess I can talk about my makeup brushes. I got a different ones. I really love these, the Real Techniques ones. I have these face, I like the face brushes. I have some of the eye ones, but I don't like them as much. So I have the Real Technique face brushes. And then I have some Morphe, <coughs> Morphe face brushes. I think I got them from like the Jaclyn Hill like favorite collection way back in the day. Which included different eye brushes. And then I have the James Charles eye brushes also from Morphe. And then the new Lisa Frank ones. These are Morphe too. So all my brushes are Morphe or a uh, real technique. Oh wait, I forgot. Some of my brushes are Sigma brushes. These were from the Jaclyn Hill Favorites collection. You guys remember Sigma? Oh my God, I totally forgot. So I have some Face Sigma and Eye Sigma. And then the rest, rest are Morphe, so. Hey. Ta-da! Henry, they done. <laughs> hey, they done. Okay, so I'm going to close off this vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I'm going to finish my reread on Dead India by Hamish Steele. I'm about halfway through. This is a sci-fi fantasy horror slice of life graphic novel that I've talked about before. It's one of my favorites. And this is the one that's going to be adapted into a Netflix show in 2021. Um... I treated myself and bought um, volume one and then volume two that I had not read yet. And I recommend this for everybody. It is funny. It's very inclusive and it has a fun, interesting plot that revolves around a haunted house in the middle of a theme park. But it reads very like slice of life. I don't know. It's it's it really has something for everyone in it. So I am loving the reread and I'm excited to finish this up tonight and then hopefully read volume two tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.